Hello everyone. So now in this video, we are going to see conversion from infix to prefix expression. So before starting, I would request you all to watch the video of conversion from infix to postfix expression because infix to prefix expression conversion is somewhat similar to that of infix to postfix expression. Well, there is just one small difference. So what is that difference? Let us understand it over here. So whenever you have an infix expression given and you have to convert it to prefix expression first of all reverse your infix expression so step one is reverse your infix expression so i will write here 5 then power then e plus then d star now here i have close parenthesis so whenever i come across close parenthesis i will write the opposite of it which is open parenthesis then i will have c then again power b plus a and then i have here open parenthesis so i will write here close parenthesis now i have this reverse expression of the infix expression now i have i will traverse from left to right and the, all the steps would be same as that of infix to postfix conversion so let us start by traversing it from left to right all the elements so first element is 5 so if the character is an operand then we'll directly push it to the output if the character is an operator then we'll push it to the stack if the stack is empty and if the stack is not empty and the character is an operator then we will do a comparison between the top element of the stack and the incoming operator and based on the comparison we'll take the decisions so first element is 5 so there will be nothing in the stack because it is not an operator in the output directly I will write it 5 over here next I have is power so power operator power is an operator so add it to the stack and over here I will have 5 only next element is E so E is what it is a character so we will not add it to the stack we will directly push it to the output so in stack power will remain the same over here 5 and here I will have E next I have is what plus now plus is an operator so what I will do I will compare it with the top element of the stack so power if you can see over here in the precedence precedence table we have the highest priority to power operator and then we have the star uh, division and plus minus and here is the associativity property meaning of the associativity property of each of these operators okay so power has the highest operator over here so top element of stack is greater than the incoming operator so what we have to do is we will simply pop out the top element of the stack and push the incoming operator so let's push the incoming operator over here and pop out the top element we will have here 5 e and power next i have is d over here so d is a character no change in stack i'll simply push it to the output value d next i have is star so star or multiplication it is an operator so compare top element of the stack is it greater than the incoming operator because plus is lower and uh, multiplication is at higher higher priority so no top element is not greater than the incoming operator so what we'll do is simply push the incoming operator into the stack so we'll have your plus and star over here in the output i will have 5 e power and d next i have what bracket so whenever open parenthesis come we will simply push it into the stack so plus star and bracket over here 5 e power d next i have it i have c so it is a character no change in stack over here 5 e power d and c next what we have after c is power so operator simply push it into the stack plus star bracket and over here i will push it into the stack output 5 e power d and c over here next is b b is a character so no changes in the stack directly push b over here 
in the output okay after b i have what plus so plus it is an operator so check with the top element of the stack so what do we have we have your power and we have your what plus so top element is greater than the incoming operator so simply pop out the top element of stack and push the incoming operator so plus multiplication and over here i will have plus this will go this will pop out 5 e d c b and this power will come over here okay after plus i have what a so i am writing it over here input stack and output so after plus what we have is a and in the stack there will be no change since it is a character star plus and output 5 e power d c b power and here a fine last i have what close parenthesis so whenever we come across close parenthesis what do we do we simply pop all the elements from the stack and till we we pop all the elements from the stack till we come across the left opening parenthesis so simply in the stack we will have plus and star and we'll pop out this plus because the before plus we have what opening left parenthesis all the elements from the stack will be pop out till we come across opening left parenthesis so in output we have 5 e power d c b power a and then plus over here okay so now we have scanned all the elements from left to right but still our stack is not empty so what we'll do finally we'll pop all the elements from the stack so the final output we get is 5 e power d c b power a plus then pop the element from stack top element star and then plus now we got this final output but hold on we have to convert it to prefix so since we have reversed this expression we will again reverse our final output so the final prefix expression will be plus star plus a power b c d power e 5 okay so this is our final prefix expression you got the output and again we have to reverse our output and get and then only we'll get the final prefix expression okay so this is how you convert from infix to prefix expression that's it from this video thank you so much for watching